built the alias for a purpose. Our goal was to, yes, make an advanced transportation vehicle, but make one that you would want to buy. We wanted it to look futuristic, feel futuristic, but also be built at a price point that almost anybody could afford. The name alias was so that it could be anything you want it to be. If it's going to be a commuter, it's a commuter. If it wants to be a race car, it could be a race car. If it wants to be something you pick up the kids from school, it could be that. Top speed of the car is 100 miles an hour. The range is a little over 100 miles. We're at least 100 miles per gallon equivalent. So you could say 100, 100, 100 was one of the targets of this vehicle. For years, some of the more conventional large companies have been fighting CAFE standards. Uh, oh, we can't get an average car up to even 26 miles per gallon. Here we have you know, 15 different vehicles in the finals that are all pretty close to 100 miles per gallon or better. If you look at how much money we're spending overseas as a country, if you look at air pollution, if you look at environmental pollution, there's so many reasons why we need to move vehicles away from petrochemicals. Why three wheels? There's several reasons. One, it's lower cost. One less wheel, one less brake, one less axle. Second, it gets registered in the United States as a motorcycle. Therefore, the hurdles to move into mass production are a lot lower. Our team is also one of the few teams that has a fairly famous race car driver. We were at an auto show about the same time the XPRIZE announced they were going to get going, and we had our little small model of the alias, and he looks at it and goes, I like the way that looks. Hi, I'm Al Unser, and uh, if you ever need a race car driver, call me. So I gave him a call and I said, Al, were you serious or just kidding? He goes, absolutely I'm serious. <laughs> he really wanted to be part of this. One of the things I think the XPRIZE has done is it made me feel that yes, the technology is here to build very efficient vehicles. And what's even more important is let's come together to get them into the marketplace. Our goal is to get the alias in production by next year. That's our current mandate, and so we're looking for those first customers. We already have a beginning of a list of customers that say they want it, but we could use some more.